Hi, how are you? Hi. I'm Dylan. Hi Dylan, my name is Ken Muirhead and I'm the learning manager of the Precision Machinist program. So you'll be showing me around? Yes. Okay. Follow me. All right. This is Jeff. Hi Jeff. Hi. Dylan. Dylan, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Jeff's going to be your guide today. Okay. It's uh, safety first in the, in the shop here. So this is where we're starting? We're here with the bandsaw here and we're going to cut some material. You crank that down, turn it like that. Until it gets tight. really tight, until you can't move it anymore. See, what I find really hard to turn might be different than what you find That's really all right. hard to turn. So you couldn't do this by hand, or could you? You could. It would just take an awful long time to do, so this, it really speeds up the process. What are we making again? Or a dovetail or something? A dovetail slide. So dovetail. basically we're going to make a couple of parts that fit together, and they're going to slide with very good accuracy, we hope. So, Does the machine turn off on its own? Or do it you? automatically stops. Cool! So the odds of losing a finger are very slim. As long as you're, you know, very safe and you don't put your hand in there while the machine is moving. Ugh. Now we're going to move over to the mill and we're going to start cutting. Alright, this is the milling machine. There you go. Should it be smoother than that? No, that's perfect. So it's very smooth part now, uh -huh. and we'll rotate it forward, cut this side, and then, and then we'll cut that side, and cut that side, and then it's going to be perfectly square. So now, we're going to replace the cutter. Okay. Lefty loosey, righty tidy. The other way. Oops. The other loosey. So the, the left? The other righty. Oh. Is this right? This left, way. right. Oops. My right. bad. You didn't see that. We can edit that part out. So we're almost there. Am I touching? Close. Keep going until you can't move anymore. Rotate it this way a little bit, and then you'll start hearing the tool cutting on the no. That's perfect. Unnatural. Now that part's done. We can move on to the last operation on this part, where we get to drill and tap a hole. All right, now we're ready to thread that hole. All right, that should be good. That's through? Yep. Is this the last part? Oops. The second last part. Okay. So you can grab the part out. Oh. There you go. Take the other part we made. And now we'll head off to the lathe and we'll make the final part. Okay. So this right. is one Slides more step. right in there. Look at that. Perfect. So this is a different metal. It's a, this is steel. So it's going to be a little harder, harder to, to cut. cut. Smoke coming off it. Pretty crazy. It stinks. Yeah, the first oh, I see what's happening. I didn't understand. It's yeah. shaving stuff like off the outside? It's shaving stuff off the outside and it's making the part concentric. So now it should be a perfect circle. Oh, it's are cool. Where's it supposed to fit? In, in the that? bottom. Oh, so you have to take a lot off there. then. So we still got quite a bit to go. Hi guys, how'd you get along? Pretty well. I think I did. Perfectly. Is it good? I think. I think maybe. Let's check it out. So that's for thickness? That's for thickness. It has, to, has, to, it has to assemble. Right, there we go. You can feel how close the fit is. Yeah. And then the taper on the turn part, right, it has to fit a mating part. So that's good? That's very good. So do I pass? You pass. What do I get, like a 99? We're talking 100 here. That's probably about a 90. A 90? Mm -hmm. What did I do wrong? Nothing. We don't. He just doesn't give hundreds. That's it. That's rough. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you, Jeff. Thank you. You're a lovely teacher. Appreciate it.